Hi guys, Tim here from ecommercemindset.com and in this video I want to talk about how you can test your website load speed. So hit that subscribe button and let's get straight into it. Now obviously when somebody comes to your site it's very very important that your page loads quickly. Everybody can appreciate that but perhaps what's less appreciated is that it can negatively affect your Google rankings should it load slowly. So there are two very simple tools that I use on a regular basis to test my various websites. One of them here that you're looking at right now is Page Speed Insights and there's a link to it in the description below. Uh, and when you click on it, you're going to arrive at this page and all you've got to do is just put in your website here. So I put in cnn.com, hit analyze and it's going to give you some results both on mobile and also on desktop. The second one that you can use is one called Pingdom where similar thing here, I've just put in cnn.com, okay, tools.pingdom.com. Again, there's a link in the description below. And you can test from various servers around the world. And it's gonna give you an idea of how well your site loads. Now, a load time of four seconds or less is actually pretty good because what you have to appreciate is that a page will load quickly and then images, etc., might load more slowly in the background. So what that means is that a user could be looking at your page within a second while other stuff loads, right? And then eventually it perhaps takes four seconds to load completely. Now, it's important to use these tools on a regular basis. Why? Because our websites are constantly changing. I think what happens with a lot of people is that they set up their site and they check initially the load speed and they think, yep, that looks great. And then they never check it again, <laughs> uh, which is wrong because we're constantly adding stuff to our sites. And you know those components could easily make it slower or perhaps faster than it was before. So make a note, put something in your, in your calendar or whatever to test once a week your site load speed. Now the primary culprit for slow loading sites is of course images, okay? Now I just wanna show you a couple of things that you can do to improve image load speed. First of all, just keep an eye on the size of your images. But if you're using something like WordPress, there is a great plugin here. So if you just search plugins, you'll find this thing, it's called Smush. And it's a very good resizing and optimizing uh, app for your images. So it'll compress them down, make them smaller, but you won't lose the quality of those images. Similarly, if you're using something like Shopify, then there's a great app on the App Store called Crush.pix, okay? Another great one basically for, again, as I say, reducing the size of your images while maintaining their quality. So there you go, a few tips on not only how to test your website load speed, but also what you can do in order to improve it. So I hope you liked the video. Please give it a thumbs up and uh, make a comment below should you so wish. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Okay, guys, see you soon.